Hi, let's take a brief look at Elasticsearch concept. First, we need to understand the data flow. Every time you insert a document in Elasticsearch, each text will be stored in index and have information where the text from, like this example. You can find John from Doc1 and Doc2, and also you can find text database from Doc1 and Doc3. Let's compare this logic to relational database. If it were a relational database, it would be like the right-hand side table. Now suppose you are Google search and suppose you use your search John in Elasticsearch. You can easily return Doc1 and Doc2 to Google result page while you will iterate through from Doc1 to Doc3 from relational database. If you are familiar with big O notation, Elasticsearch is like order 1 while relational database is order n. In short, when it comes to search, Elasticsearch guarantees much faster performance. Here is the data structure of Elasticsearch. Each index has types and each type has multiple documents. Document is in JSON type and you can find one type has document has same properties. If you are familiar with relational database, here is the comparison table. Index is a database, type is a table, document is a row, field is a column, and mapping is a schema. Also, Elasticsearch uses REST API to perform create, read, update, and delete. Again, if you are familiar with relational database, here is the comparison table. So, here is the example of read, create, update, and delete. As you can see here, you can use curl to send REST API for these actions and here's the relational database comparison for your understanding. We will take a deep look at these actions on the next video. Thank you.